Hey guys, welcome back to more My GM. I'll be honest, I don't remember anything that happened because the last time I filmed my last two episodes, it's actually like a huge gap. So apparently Mia Yim wants the main event. Okay, so I don't even remember my roster. So I gotta look at my roster. Okay, we have like five, 10, 14. We have 14 wrestlers, okay. A uh, good amount of them are in feuds. I'm looking at stamina, and a lot of people kind of have lower stamina than I want, like what I would prefer. So, looking at that, I'm a little bit worried, but, I mean, I don't know. And again, I don't know what happened the last two episodes. We got Undertaker as Intercontinental Champion. Mia Yim wants a main event. So, here's what I'm going to do for Mia Yim, okay? You. Actually... Fatal four way tables. Mia Yim, Liv Morgan, Shayna Baszler. Uh, and apparently they want Gigi Dolan to cut a promo. So I'm going to do that. And wait, is that what it is? Is that what they wanted? Ensure Gigi Dolan cuts a promo. Okay. So who are you feuding with? Zelina Vega? So obviously you're going to cut a promo against Zelina Vega. Triple H is that good? Yes, it is. So. That's great. Now, we have Intercontinental Champion Undertaker here. And we have Kane. I think Undertaker and Kane can do a call-out promo. We can have them have a rivalry. And I'm going to see here because we got... Hmm, I don't know. Stamina is really low right now. So I'm going to put you against Solo Sokoa in the opening match. Uh, I guess I'll do you and Punk. I'm actually very... Very worried about stamina right now. Um, like, this is really, really bad. This is going to be a really bad show. I don't think this show is going to do well. This show is not going to do well. Um, I didn't even book everyone in a promo at this show. I forgot. Um, well, what happened on the other shows? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I mean, we didn't do terrible. I mean... We didn't do terrible. No, no no, crazy injuries, I'd say. I mean, we got more fans than everyone else. Injury rehab. I mean, look, we... Oh, you know something? Do we have a stamina thing? Do we have a stamina thing? Uh, Sasha's stamina below level 40. She's becoming injured. Put me in a match with The Undertaker. I mean, that was my intention. <laughs> you want a shot at the Universal Championship. Okay, let me... All right, everyone needs to relax with asking for stuff, okay? I Hold on. <laughs> hold on a minute. Oh, John Cena. Oh, we're getting him. We're getting this John Cena. I don't even care. Like, doesn't matter. John Cena is being gotten. Okay. So, uh, why is Kane and Undertaker not in a feud right now? That That's not what we're trying to... Kane, you don't want it this week, do you? Uh, in three weeks. Uh, okay, they said three weeks. So JD McDonough versus Bray Wyatt needs to happen at some point in three weeks. Now, let me look. Quick recovery. This is the perfect time to use it, I feel like. Um, and that is how... Yeah, yep. I wanted to use it at some point, and we still have six random superstars on the roster. We'll have their popularity increase. I'm not even going to use it yet. We're going to go ahead and buy Health Spa as well, so that we just make sure that we're good. Just make sure that we're okay. Now we got $300,000. We just bought John Cena, okay? Here's what we're going to do. I am going to book... Wait, John Cena's heel? Okay, how about Bray Wyatt and John Cena? for the championship with Gable interfering on Bray Wyatt. Okay, let's do that. And then anything Triple H? Okay, Triple H wanted a Falls Count Anywhere match. How about Undertaker and Kane? How about you guys go for the Intercontinental title? Falls Count Anywhere. Apparently the stamina cost is gonna be extreme, uh, but you guys have really good stamina, so you guys should be okay. And we need more rivalries, obviously, so you and Solo Sokoa are good, JD McDonough and Punk are good, Shayna Baszler, uh, I'm going to do you and Gigi Dolan again in that little promo, but Liv Morgan, you need a feud with somebody too, so I'm going mm, to put you with Sasha Banks, 
Um, and there's not really anyone else I could throw in a feud, so I'm just gonna have Mia Yim cut a promo. And then we'll do Sasha Shayna? Uh, stamina is still low for Sasha Banks. Um, so I'm not gonna do that. But uh, how about you and Solo Sokoa just do a crazy match or something? Like, yeah. Hopefully it doesn't, I don't know. I feel like the main event match is not gonna perform good. I don't know. Um, but we're gonna, I don't, I don't know if I'm doing the most correct strategy for this uh, GM mode. I don't know if I'm doing it right. Am I doing it right? But guys, this is also streamed on Twitch, so if you guys want to see this live, you can go over to the Twitch stream. Yeah, so main event was not considered strong, but we got John Cena as champion. This is That's kind of what I wanted to do because Gable and Bray are in a feud right now. So I did want to do that. Why aren't you guys in a rivalry? That is annoying. That That's, that's really annoying. Okay, so we suffered from our main event apparently not seeming as good. Uh, we're number two right now. We still got more money than all of them. And we're, we still have, yeah, despite hiring John Cena. So I know you want to face Chad Gable again. Um, you want to work at SmackDown? 127? Nah. I, as, as much as that, so, I, you know, it sounded good. Don't get me wrong. But I need to hire like someone like Dakota Kai, right? So, I don't know though, man, I'm gonna lose so much money, but I need to hire more um, women's wrestlers because we have, okay, let's hire Raquel. Uh, she's a face. Do we have a heel women's wrestler that is not permanent? Let's see, 10 weeks. I'm looking for like five weeks. But, okay, Brie Bella. All right, we're gonna go with all that. I know you're trying to face him. Hmm. I'm like looking over here. JD McDonough still wants a shot at the world title. You know something, we have to, we have to give him a shot at it. So we might as well uh, open the show with John Cena and JD McDonough with uh, CM Punk interfering against uh, not John Cena, uh, JD McDonough. Yes. And then, hmm. Undertaker and Kane, please start a rivalry. Please. Now, Brie Bella. I want Brie Bella and Raquel Rodriguez to do the exact same thing because we need more feuds. Um, anyone else with the promo? We're going to keep that the same. I think I'm going to put... Morgan and Baszler in a match against each other. I'm gonna do Sasha Banks and Mia Yim um, in a rivalry. I think I'm gonna do Liv Morgan and Shayna Baszler for the women's title. Wait, no, 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 what am I doing? No, we'll do. We'll put it in the main event, and we're gonna make it a tables match. What was the commissioner goal? Tables match. Oh, perfect. Um, tag team match. Let's do. Hmm. I don't even know if we can. How about you guys on the opposite teams? Uh, and then we do like, oh, I can't do like Kane and Undertaker. I can do you and Solo Sokoa. This match would look really awkward though. Um, I guess Gigi Dolan and Queen Zelina. Yeah, I guess. I guess that makes sense. Um, let's, yeah, that's fine. That works. I don't know. This pay-per-view build is a little, a little, it's a little bit more awkward than the uh, previous ones, but I think we could still pull out a really good pay-per-view. They got Trick Williams. I want Trick Williams. Okay, well, the good news, poor opener is bad news, but the good news is the main event was good. But we got one feud out of that whole entire thing. I, ah, oh, this isn't good. <laughs> this is not good at all. Free advertising booking, thank you. Uh, we need to have our pay-per-view soon. Um, yes, I, DQ cost me next time. Yeah, I, oh yeah, the DQ. 
Um, you want to face someone other than Gigi Dolan. Okay. So, hmm, let's see what we can do here. <laughs> we got $400,000 right now. Hmm, $400,000. Any other? Blair Davenport, you're coming on the show. Nick Inspo is available. <laughs> I am available, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not going to... I'm not going to do that. But Blair Davenport is here. So, okay. Shayna Baszler is a double champion. John Cena needs a rivalry. So, we're going to... Who isn't in a rivalry? Cena and Kane. Wait. Cena and Kane. Can that even work? No. Uh... Because everyone else is in an actual rivalry, so it's kind of hard. So I guess we're just going to do Cena and The Undertaker. And we're going to try to do that Intercontinental Champion versus uh, Universal Champion. Since they don't want to do Kane. Um, and then the main event can be... <sighs> what can the main event even be? Um, I'm, I'm going to have you guys have like a crazy match. You guys are going to do... You guys are going to do a steel cage match. It's going to cost a lot of money, but we need to have a really good, like, thing going. So, with that, okay, so, let's see. I'm really struggling on what to do here. How about Blair Davenport and Zelina Vega with interference from Gigi Dolan? Um, and then... Got the tag team titles with the Intercontinental Champion. So Kane and Chad Gable. Uh, Wyatt is going to watch this match, of course. Um, and then JD McDonough and Punk. I know you guys are still in a rivalry. We're going to do that with you guys. And then we're going to do that with you and Cedric Alexander. And then I just want to, I need to add like one more little match on here. And I don't know what to do. Stamina is good on you. I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do you and CM Punk. I can do Mia Yim and Liv Morgan just to have a little match. I'm not gonna do Triple H's Commissioner goal this time. Uh, let's go ahead and see. Okay, nothing, nothing crazy that I really want here. Raise the popularity of superstars with the lowest popularity by 15%. We're not going to use that yet. And I also don't want to do that for someone who has a five-week contract if that's, like, the case. So we're not going to do that yet. And then we're simulating. Wow, we did not do very good this week. And that actually kind of... Mm, our champions don't have like uh, like our champs don't have like big rivalries we're kind of in trouble right now uh partnership in the next few weeks i don't really do that partnership stuff you love being in a certain match a tables match okay sure uh you want to be in a tables match we're gonna we're gonna put you in a tables match Tonight, and what is it? Book your least popular available star for a match. So who is that? Who is that? That is Blair Davenport. But you don't have a rivalry, so I don't know if I'm going to do that. Now, here's the problem. Actually, no, you know what? So Shayna Baszler and Liv Morgan is going to main event the show because... Uh, which, okay, the Extreme Rules is the brand PLE bonus because, yeah, so, and then John Cena versus kind of like whoever is going to be in the middle of this. So John Cena and let's do Kane. John Cena and Kane for the world title. We're going to kick things off with, yeah, 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 this match. This match is perfect. Um, kick things off with this match. And then I think CM Punk and JD McDonough. Um, as far as like literally everything else, I'm a little bit, oh, wait, no, wait, there might be a better match here. Wait, wait let me get rid of this because this match has much more of like a, I don't know. So 
How about... Okay, I'm going to try Kane and The Undertaker again. And then I'm actually going to try John Cena in a self-promo instead. I'm going to have Sasha Banks and Blair Davenport go at it. And then, I guess... Uh, who has the lowest popularity? Um, besides that, it's Kane, but they're in like matches and stuff. So I'm gonna go me again. And then we use Extreme Rules. We're gonna buy this. That was a lot of money though, but you know what? It's okay. We could do Vito Random Superstar. Double cost. We're gonna do double cost for NXT. Birth of Legends. Hmm. And I think that's what we're gonna do for now. I'm gonna buy this because this is awesome. So we're going to do Vito Random Superstar for Raw. So it's screwing over both shows here. Um, and yeah. So there we go. We're going to simulate this. And we're going to simulate every other show. Beautiful. Now, how did we do? We are a great main event. A couple of completed rivalries. All right, all right, very good, very good. Uh, this sh this was four stars though, so that is gonna confuse fans. How else did you guys do? Um, I mean, Raw kind of followed the right path in a way. I don't know about NXT, what did NXT do? NXT just didn't really have that amazing of star ratings because the fans grew, grew tired to a lot of their rivalries. We gained the most fans. We had the best show with the best pay-per-view when that helped us, that saved us, and that brought us back to the top again. Awesome. What was that stunt you pulled? Uh, you're the fall guy every week. You're a master on the mic. Okay. What do we give him here? Gain two power cards. Use it. Okay. Using at least one spe- Whoa, wait a second. This is going to go crazy. Using at least one specialist superstar in a match increases its quality. Guys, this power card is gonna be a massive cheat killer to this game. Dude, I think we just won based off of that power card, right? Or whatever that is, the shakeup thing. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.